I'm Tad Schilt. And I'm Dan Ramos. During your first period classes, you have the opportunity to earn donuts. The first three period classes with the lowest percentages of tardies in the month of November will receive donuts in December. Do you or your club want to perform in the Black Eyed Valley on Friday, January 20th? If you have a performance that is not been given an opportunity to come, please know that not all acts of time will be done for, and all performances must be pre approved with guests and accompanies. Wolfpack Performing Arts will be showing a family reunion to die for this Friday and Saturday. Showings will be Friday at 7 p.m. and Saturday at 2 p.m. and 7 p.m. Tickets are $10 and can be purchased through the QR code or the student store. Last year's yearbook is on sale in the student store for only $20. You can stop by their both lunches and pay a or card. Make sure to get yourself a copy before they're gone forever. Now, let's pass it on to Nisha and Ethan for entertainment.
Thanks, Nisha and Ethan. Wow, I can't believe Ash Ketchum is actually the champion now. I mean, he's only 10 years old. He's been like that for what, three decades? Yeah, not that long. Anyway, now we got to pass it on to Darren and Jonah for sports. What's up, Wolfpack? I'm Darren Francis. I'm Jonah Mercado. And this is your sports update. Let's go. Andy McDonald on our varsity boys cross country made it to state. <laughs> Jonah, the man does have a ton of records. I mean, that's without a doubt the best thing you've heard for sports all year. We'll be sure to cover his progress as the year goes on. Go, Matthew. In the NFL, Darren, the time is it. C come on, man. I just heard this from Ethan. Raiders lose to Colts. 20-25. The better game, though, is the Vikings-Bills game. Hey, man, don't change the subject. I mean, that game was crazy. The Vikings have been doing really good this entire year. This win, putting them at 8-1. The system Kirk Cousins and Je Justin Jefferson have is astounding. And I mean, that one-handed catch, am I right? Yeah, but don't forget about the Bills' defense, Von Miller, as well as quarterback Josh Allen with three turnovers, and they were previously leading the AFC. I think the real MVP of the game for me, though, has to be Patrick Peterson with a game-winning interception and a minute and 12 seconds left. Other good news, the Kings won last night over the Brooklyn Nets. Love to see it. The game was also really fun to watch. I mean, the Nets were smoked defensively. They had no way to answer to Terrence Davis, 31 points, breaking a 40-point tie midway through the game. Kevin Durant had a decent performance from the Nets. 27 points is not bad, but what to do 3 to 121 to for itself. Most points allowed on the net is in their history. Wow. And moving across the water, the FIFA World Cup in Qatar is starting soon. The United States is slated to play Wales on November 21st, 11 a.m. We probably won't get too far. Sorry, guys. Leading right now is Brazil. We'll be sure to keep you up here. Well, as always, I'm Darren Francis. And I'm Joan Mercado. Stay tuned and back to the Yankees. The final deadline for senior portraits is Monday, November 28th, which means you have about a week and a half to ensure you're featured in this year's yearbook, including Thanksgiving break. See the yearbook website, the senior Google Classroom, or the newsletter for more info. Well, that's all we have for you today, Wolfpack. I'm Tad Schoep. And the strength of the wolf is the pack. Happy National Fast Food Day, Wolfpack. <laughs>